Hello, I'm Mason Gorelick reporting for the news feed. This is your feed update for Tuesday, February 23rd. A space station supply ship has blasted into orbit from Virginia on the 59th anniversary of John Glenn's historic flight. Northrop Grumman launched the capsule from Wallops Island on Saturday. The four-ton shipment should reach the International Space Station on Monday. It is Northrop Grumman's 15th supply run for NASA. The company has named its latest capsule the SS Katherine Johnson after the black NASA mathematician profiled in the movie Hidden Figures. Her numbers contributed to the February 20th, 1962 flight in which Glenn became the first American to orbit the world. The wife of Mexican drug kingpin, El Chapo, is expected to appear in federal court in Washington by video chat on Tuesday. She was arrested in the United States Monday and is accused of helping her husband run his multi-million dollar cartel and plot his escape from a Mexican prison in 2015. The Justice Department says 31-year-old Emma Espiro, a dual citizen of the U.S. and Mexico, was arrested at Dulles Air International Airport. Her husband was sentenced to life behind bars in 2019. Virginia lawmakers have advanced a new version of bipartisan school reopening legislation that would tighten the requirements for in-person instruction that districts must offer in the next school year. The lawmakers negotiating the bill said Monday that the aim of the latest version is to require school districts grappling with the pandemic to offer a full-time in-person option for students with limited exceptions. If a school has a high levels of transmission of the coronavirus, it could temporarily revert to virtual learning under the measure. A committee advanced the latest version of the bill Monday to the House. And that is your feed update for this Tuesday, February 23rd. As always, stay connected with us on Twitter and Facebook for more news and information. I'm Mason Grelick. Thank you for watching.